What's up guys? Do you dig a cat hole when you go hiking? I hope you do. And for those of those who don't know what a cat hole is, literally you dig a hole and that's where you go to the bathroom. And also keep in mind you do not put your toilet paper in that hole. You literally take a one gallon Ziploc bag and you pack your um, toilet paper out. What do they say? Keep calm, dig a cat hole. That's what they say. This is a Vargo Titanium. Basically digs a hole. Has uh, serrated edges along the edge. Let's see if I can show you that. All the way along the edge here. And that's to cut the roots. And you can get a really good grip on it. It feels really good on the ham. I don't feel any sharp points whatsoever. And it does have a certain amount, but what's it weigh? I mean, total weight of this thing is 1.3 ounces. I mean, it pretty much weighs nothing. 1.3 ounces is what that weighs. Now, some people will swear up and down if you use trekking poles, they'll use their trekking pole to dig their hole. Other people will use a plastic shovel. Um, everybody's got a different way of doing it, but one thing's for sure, if you're new to hiking and you haven't done it, then maybe you want to pick up the Vargo Titanium. And this is made of titanium, that's why it's so light for uh, digging yourself a hole. Or you may want to just use your trekking pole. I prefer to use something like this myself personally. A lot of people prefer to use a plastic type of shovel. You can pick them up all over the place, even at your local hardware store. But... Um, I would say if you're completely new, pick up something, either this or a plastic shovel or something just to make your life easier. Now what I normally do when I roll in the camp and uh, I start pulling apart my knapsack, after I get my hammock set up and everything's all good to go, then sometimes, it depends on if it's getting dark or not, I mean, I'll go dig a couple holes with this. Or, you know, after I eat I'll go and dig a couple holes. And I'll pick out a couple spots. Now keep in mind, you just can't go wherever you feel like it. You gotta be like 200 feet away from water, 200 feet away from a path. I mean, you kinda wanna put some distance between stuff. You don't want to, you know, be, to de be destroying the environment around you. And uh, the other thing about it is that when you're done and you put the hole back in, I think you go like six, eight inches. I go, I go pretty deep with mine. You should be able to step on the hole after is what you should be able to do with no stress or worries whatsoever if you've done it correctly. Now, a lot of times you should take a little stick and kind of stick it straight up and down a flag pole. It. That really comes in handy when you're on very, very busy trails. You don't want somebody coming along and not knowing something's been done there and then they start digging their hole and, wow, surprise! <laughs> you <know? laughs> so, you stick a stick in it, it will, and anybody that's experienced will know and say, oh, okay, I know what that is. You know, but this is uh, by Vargo, and it's the titanium digger. You can also use this as a tent, tent uh, peg. This is why they got uh, the loops around here if you want to use it as a tent peg. I mean, biggest thing in the hiking world, the biggest thing in the hiking world is obviously multi-use for products, and that's what everybody's trying to do. Vargo also says you can use this as a snow anchor where you turn it sideways, and uh, you put the snow on top of it. And then uh, you can use it as a snow anchor also. Don't get a whole lot of snow in Tennessee. But, who knows, you might. And uh, I don't know if you'd use it as a tent peg. I mean, leave one tent peg home, take this with you and use it as one. I imagine you could. But uh, if you're looking for yourself a cat hole digger, this is by Vargo. It's made out of titanium, super light. I'll have the links in the bottom and uh, you can pick one up. What do you guys use? Let me know if you actually hike. Do you use the plastic shovels? Do you use your, um, you know, your walking pole? What do you actually use for taking care of business? Catch you guys later.